Terra. Where is he going? First, this can only mean Master Zaynor was right. Mm -hmm. What's Master Zaynor doing here? Maybe he found something out. Sorry to bother you, sir. Oh, oh what a well-mannered lass you are. Oh, I'd be pleased as punch to help you, if I can. I'm looking for a boy who's not from around here. Have you seen him? Hmm, I think I know just who you're talking about. He scampered off toward yon castle in a right hurry. Thank you so much. Oh, ho, ho. Tara, I hope you're still there. Huh? Hold on. The castle is presently closed. But somebody just came this way. He's a friend of mine. We aren't aware of any visitors. Now run along home, boy, before the monsters get you. I could have sworn it was him. Huh? They're here! Radiant Garden shall not fall under the lights of you. Leave this to me! Stop! But you're just a child! Uh. <sighs> Now, who do you think will defend the castle huh? if you two huh? go skipping off? But... that boy... Never you worry about him. He's a special case. A what? Evan is right. Lord and castle come first. The boy will have to fend for himself. Which reminds me, his lordship was asking for you. A heart devoid of darkness, stripped clean of it at that. Very questionable. <laughs> Why can't I ever seem to remember this address exactly? Excuse me, Your Elderness. Huh? I believe you dropped this book. Did I? Oh, uh, I'm very sad to say this isn't one of mine, but what a remarkable book it is. This unassuming volume seems to have the unusual effect of awakening one's innermost abilities. A book that makes people stronger? 
If it's all right, Your Elderness, might I have a closer look? The name is Merlin. I'm a powerful wizard, and I'll have you know a lot of wisdom comes with age. Anyway, as I said, the book is not mine, but I'd be happy to keep it here for you. Thank you, Merlin. Back off, you fiend! <laughs> You'll not be getting my money! Uh, look out! I, I will! <laughs> Hold on. Wait a moment, laddie. Uh, don't I even get a chance to repair you? Oh, you don't have to. <laughs> now just hold your horses. I didn't mean my fortune. Maybe a wee bit of gold, uh, or a small token of... Well, could you make it fast? I know. I've just the thing in my hat. Hmm? <laughs> Come here. Huh? You can tell me, lad, you came here from another world, didn't you? <laughs> Don't worry. My bill is sealed. Your secret's safe with me. I'm not be asking you any awkward questions. You see, tis the same with me. I asked a wizard named Merlin to bring me here from another world. After all, adventure is the mother of industry, eh? Eh? Great! That all? Ugh, but I'm holding you up, lad, eh? Here, these are lifetime passes to Disney Town. You love buckets of fun there. Or my name is not Scrooge McDuck. <laughs> there you are. Enough for you and two grown-ups. Aqua. I train under Master Ericus. And I'm Mickey. I used to be Yen Sid's apprentice. I came back to him for some more training. I sense light within this girl. You think that's why they attacked her? Yep. I think you might be absolutely right. If you ask me, she must be somebody pretty extraordinary. <sighs> yes. I'm quite certain she's someone we're supposed to protect. Let's join forces! Oh no! Not now! I'll be okay! <laughs> See you real soon! <gasps> Here! Are these for me? I picked you some flowers. Thank you for saving me. Oh, they're lovely. You're so sweet. My name's Kyrie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. I'm Aqua. Kyrie, about that light. Kyrie! Oh. Oh, Grandma! Wait, Kyrie, just a minute. <sighs> I just cast a magic spell on you. One day, when you're in trouble, the light within you 
will lead you to the light of another. Someone to keep you safe. Thanks! <laughs> there you are. <laughs> it's time to go. Okay. Oh. <sighs> Bye! <sighs> hey, Grandma? Hmm? What is it? Could you tell me that story? <laughs> Again, dear? Please. <laughs> Very well, then. <laughs> Long ago, people lived in peace, bathed in the warmth of light. Everyone loved the light. Then, people began to fight over it. They wanted to keep it for themselves, and darkness was born in their hearts. The darkness spread, swallowing the light in many people's hearts. It covered everything, and the world disappeared. But small fragments of light survived in the hearts of children. With these fragments of light, children rebuilt the lost world. It's the world we live in now. But the true light sleeps deep within the darkness. That's why the worlds are still scattered, divided from each other. But someday, a door to the innermost darkness will open, and the true light will return. So listen, child. Even in the deepest darkness, there will always be a light to guide you. Believe in the light and the darkness will never defeat you. Your heart will shine with its power and push the darkness away. Mm-hmm. Kyrie, something tells me I didn't run into her by accident. First, it never ends! Ain't it all! Can't I get a moment's peace? <laughs> Mister, get inside! It's not safe out here! Oh, ordering me about! Now that's unsafe! After all, I'm Merlin, the wizard! Oh, <laughs> another scamp looking to wake the powers inside him! Is that it? What? How'd you know? <laughs> we wizards have a knack for knowing such things. The book is inside on the table. You may have a gander if you like. What book? Over there! Then? Red. Terra! Aqua! <laughs> <laughs> Got him. We make a good team. Sure do. Oh, yeah. I got you these tickets. For what? Lifetime passes to Disney Town. He said to... He said to take two grown-ups. You mean us? <laughs> <laughs> Listen to me, Ven. We need to get you home. It's okay, Aqua. 
Trust me, that guy in the mask is history. I'll never badmouth Terra again. You saw the boy in the mask? Uh, he... yes? Venetus. Ven, you let Aqua take you home. No way! I want to go with you guys. You can't. We have a dangerous task ahead of us. I don't want you to get hurt. And what is this dangerous task, Terra? It doesn't sound like what the Master told you to do. It might be a different route, but I'm fighting the darkness. I'm not so sure. I've been to the same worlds as you, and... I've seen what you've done. You should have put yourself so close to the darkness. Oh. Listen to yourself, Aqua. Terra would never... You mean you've been spying on me? Is that what he said to do? The Master's orders? He was only... Aqua? I get it. Terra! Just stay put! I'm on my own now. All right? Terra, please, listen! The Master has no reason to distrust you, really! He was just worried! You're awful, Aqua. Mm. So now you know the truth. But the Master loves Terra. And you know that too. Were you also... Ordered to take me home? Aqua, now that you're a Keyblade Master, you've let it go to your head. I'm gonna go find Terra. Master Xehanort is the only one I could still count on. You must be Terra. It's that old coot. He won't stop asking for you. I came all the way out here to get you, just so he'd clam up. What do you mean? Ha! Do I have to spell it out? Xehanort, whatever he's called. You know, my prisoner. <laughs> You're apparently not a very good liar. Master Xehanort would never let himself be caught by a thug like you. As if. I got the old coot at my mercy. See for yourself. I'm holding him underneath the outer gardens. You better show up before I lose my patience. Ciao. There's no way it's true. But no harm in looking. Master Xehanort! The old coot certainly knows how to take punishment. Just like I know how to deal it out. You monster! What are you after? That thing right there. It's called the Keyblade, isn't it? Yep. Seems like these days everybody's got one of those. Even Grandpa there. When I nabbed him, he told me all about it. What a weapon like that can do. How could I not want one? Well, you'll find they're picky about their owners. <laughs> if I heard the old guy right, 
You're what they call Keyblade Master Material. So if I defeat you, that makes me the real Keyslinger. If you catch my drift. Not the most polite way to go about it. But what can you do? Uh, uh, one more step and the coot goes boom. You think I'm gonna fight fair? As if. That key's too powerful for us to go mano a mano. <laughs> for a Keyblade Master, you're not very... What's the word? Good? <laughs> what are you doing, Tara? Fight! But Master, you'll... Never mind me! You must fight! You can't let this ruffian win! Think of your master, Ericus! The shame he and your fellow pupils would be forced to bear! Use the Keyblade! So much for the bluff. Well done, Terra. You have taken yet another step forward. But I was consumed by anger. Hatred. That was the power of darkness. Darkness that you channeled. No. I succumbed to it. Just like when I stole Princess Aurora's Heart of Light. I can never return home now. I'm a failure. Then don't. You could be my pupil. <laughs> Master Ericus, you see, is so afraid of darkness that he too has succumbed. Not to darkness, but to light. It shines so bright, he forgets that light begets darkness. And Aqua and Ventus, their lights shine too bright. It is only natural that they cast shadows on your heart. Ericus, you're such a fool! Light and darkness, they are a balance. One that must always be maintained. Terra, you are the one who shows the true mark of mastery. But he refuses to see it. And I know why. It is because he fears you. Join me. You and I can do the world's much greater good. By wielding light and darkness in equal shares. Master Xehanort. See more worlds. Seek out the darkness that upsets the balance. Find Vanitas and bring an end to him. Master Terra. So, where are you? Answer me! Ah, there you are. Didn't I warn you not to wander off, child? I see we owe you our thanks. 
We have done our best to raise the boy, since his poor parents are not here to do it. Oh. You're on your own, huh? Sir, I'm looking for a friend of mine. He's a tall guy, dressed kinda like me. Have you seen him? Hmm. Perhaps I did see him in the outer gardens. Just follow this road. Thank you. No, thank you for keeping Yenso out of harm's way. And, well, let's say, I have a feeling we are destined to cross paths again. I can't do that, Ven. Uh, why not? I just... When I really need you, Ven, I know you'll be there. <laughs> well, why wouldn't I? You're my friend. Yeah. You're right. Thanks, Ven. I just, when I really need you, Ven, I know you'll be there. Oh. I better tell Aqua. Hey! You old coot! You said I wouldn't get hurt! I didn't sign up to be collateral damage! No way! As if! Okay, okay, fine, fine. Just, just, just put that down. You still need me. You still need me to do something, right? And all I'm asking is that you hold up your end of the bargain. <laughs> I mean, what's a little scratch on my face, huh? All things considered. I'm just lucky he didn't steal my heart like Princess, whatever it was. <laughs> that would have ruined my week for sure. Unlikely. A powerful light still lives inside of Terra. You see, people like him, they don't have the power to steal hearts. So wait, you mean... He's not the one who stole her heart? Oh, just as I said it would happen, here's the third one. That book is almost more trouble than it's worth. Uh, uh, Say no more. The book you need to awaken the powers within you is just inside. Read to your heart's content, my dear. I'm the third? Terra and Ventus were here? A mask? You're the boy that Ventus mentioned. Ah, yes. Ventus. Tell me something. Has he learned to put up a decent fight yet? What do you mean? I'll be asking the questions. And why shouldn't I? After all, between the two of us, I'm the only one who'll walk away from here alive. <sighs> Guess again! Are you? <laughs> Not bad at all. Congratulations. I'll keep you around. 
Never hurts to have a backup. I have to stop him. Before anything else happens to Terra and Ven. Aqua! Ven! Were you able to find him? Yeah, but... He's gone. Right. Then I can't stay here. Let me go with you, Aqua. No, Ven. Do as I say and go home. Uh, why won't you let me? I don't want to put you in harm's way. You understand? Given up already? Come on, Ven. I thought you were stronger than that. Ven, you almost had him. Just try it again. Hey, wait. You're teaming up now? You see all those dents and nicks you got? Each one of those is proof you're learning. You're trying too hard to move your body. You need to learn to let your body move you. Right? <clears throat> In your hand, take this blade. And so long as you have the makings, then through this simple act of taking, its wielder you shall one day be made. <laughs> What's that about? Who went and made you master? Being a Keyblade Master is all I've dreamed about. Well, you're not the only one. I know. You, me, and Ven all share the same dream. This yours? Lee, we don't have time for this. Lighten up, Isa. It'll only take a sec. You still play with toy swords? That's cute. Mm. Now this right here... Ta-da! What do you think? Not a whole lot. You're just jealous. I'm Lee. Got it memorized? What's your name? Ventus. Okay, Ventus, let's fight. Fight? Why would I want to do that? You scared of losing? Come on. <laughs> Hope you're ready. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now we're talking. You're gonna be sorry. <laughs> uh <laughs> You... had enough? Cause I'm willing to call it a draw if you are. Huh? <laughs> right. From where I stood, the only thing you drew was a big L on your forehead for loser, lame, laughable. What? Isn't this the part where you cheer me up or something? You're just having a bad day, or that's what you get for pulling your punches. 
<sighs> Some friend. Oh, you mean I was supposed to lie? You see what I gotta put up with? Sure hope you don't have friends like him. Huh? <laughs> 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 Lee, we have to go. Okay. Already? I'll see you when I see you. After all, we're friends now. <laughs> Get it memorized. Okay, Lee. What is it with you and picking up stray puppies? I want everybody I meet to remember me. Inside people's memories, I can live forever. I know I won't forget you. Believe me, I try all the time. See? I'm immortal. You're obnoxious. You ready? Well, I can tell you are. Must be nice. <laughs> Knowing who your friends are. <laughs>